Back here at the 13th floor Uptown Lowdown, and time for some live shows this week. Yeah. What are we going to see? What's the first one up? Um, Lily Van Buzzkirk, Annabelle Lee, and Emmanuel at the Wine Cellar. My um, look on Under the Radar says that their genre <laughs> is digital angel core um, and what is pop that? rock. I have no idea. <laughs> but from what I checked out, it sort of, to me, sounded like quite EDM. Like digital is definitely a good way of describing it. Right. Um, it sounds really interesting. All right. So that's Wednesday. And on Thursday, I see Lips is going to be at Neck of the Woods. Cool. So Lips have been up here before, Steph Brown and, uh, and Finn. And so they have a new album out. It came out a couple of months ago called I Don't Know Why I Do Anything. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Pretty relatable. <laughs> and, and, and Steph's been busy doing all sorts of things with other people, so it'll be good to see her and, and Finn doing their own thing at the Neck of the Woods. Always a good show. Cool. Uh, I highly recommend it. Something else happening on Thursday I think you're kind of excited yeah, about. Yeah, Spacey Jane at the Power Station. Pumped for that one. I think our friends Park Road are actually opening for them, which is such a good gig for those guys. They've been doing really well as well. Ah. But yeah, I haven't seen Spacey Jane before, but listened to a lot of their music and really excited to see cool, them live. Cool, cool. And then Friday, Kane Strang will be at the Whammy. He has, his most recent album is called Happy to Perform, so apparently he's going to be happy to perform yeah. for us oh, he at the Whammy. <laughs> and he's got quite a band with him. A uh, guy, Peter Riddell, who we've talked to before, yep. he's in Wax Chattels and Sulfate, so he's going to be playing keyboards there. A guy named Leith Towers and Mitchell Innes and, and oh, Gussie Larkin from Mermaidens is going to be there in cool. Earth Tongue. So it's kind of an all-star band. Yeah. So I, I'll definitely kind of catch that one. Looks exciting. And on Saturday, we have Ben and Brody and the Dawn and Sand Trap at Cassette 9. Again, what the um, heck? <laughs> very interesting because I feel like, again, that Saturday gig and that Wednesday gig almost could be switched around. I feel like Ben and Brody would be better at the wine cellar and, and yep. um, those other guys at Cassette 9. Um, from what I checked out, it looks like they're a, a duo still in high school, sort of like killing it in Smoke Free Rockcrest. Kind and, of imagines a lot, lot of me when I was a kid. If I'm not mistaken, I saw the show starts at 7.30. I wouldn't be surprised. At cassette nine, because yeah, yeah. you'll probably have to probably be in bed be, by nine. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> um, but it looks like they're doing really well at what they're doing um, and playing a lot of gigs for their age. So, you know, why not start early? All right, so there's some good stuff there. We'll have reviews and photos on the 13th cool. floor once they do their thing. Yeah. The 13th Floor Uptown Lowdown is brought to you in part by a grant from the New Zealand Music Commission and by the Uptown Business Association. <laughs>